What is up YouTube? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 15 Ultimate Team video. And today guys, what you're going to be watching is a simple head-to-head -head seasons game. But I'm not really going to be talking about the game that you're seeing here. What I want to actually talk about is the real NFL. Specifically, I want to talk about my Dallas Cowboys. Now, um, for those of you who don't know, I am a pretty big Dallas Cowboys fan. Have been watching all of the off-season stuff that's been going on here. And, you know... I, I've been so disappointed in the past with what the Cowboys have done because I feel like they made so many bad decisions. But this year, honestly, I'm feeling okay about it. Um, we just lost DeMarco Murray to the Philadelphia Eagles, which is obviously a, a big blow. Uh, to lose your starting running back, the guy who led the league in rushing just the last year uh, to a division rival is never a good thing. But the reality of the situation is that it came down to whether the Cowboys wanted to keep DeMarco Murray or Des Bryant. And the truth is, is that despite the fact that the running game was the reason that they were so successful last year, this team still values and should value Des Bryant more than they value DeMarco Murray. Because the reality is that Des Bryant is an elite talent at a much more difficult to find position. The running back position, in my personal opinion, is one of the easiest positions to find at least acceptable talent at. Wide receiver is not that way. And uh, to me, it just made sense for them to keep Des Bryant. And, you know, it could be a tough situation with his contract over the next couple of years. But um, the, the reality, like I said, is that they just couldn't keep both of these players. So it makes sense to get rid of or, um, you know, I, I shouldn't say get rid of like they're pushing him aside. But to let DeMarco Murray walk away. And, and, they, and it ended up sucking that he went to the Eagles of all teams. But, um, it, you know, all things considered, it, it made sense for them to get rid of him. Um but now you look at the fact that this team is, uh, they're in a tough situation at the running back position because DeMarco Murray is a very, very talented player. And now they're kind of looking at their running back situation basically being Joseph Randall, Lance Dunbar, and the newest addition to the team, Darren McFadden. Now, a lot of people are thinking about Darren McFadden as the guy who uh, basically set the world on fire a few years ago. And when I say a few years ago, I mean, it, it was quite a few years ago at this point. Um, but uh, Darren McFadden has had moments where he looks like arguably the best running back in football. Now, I'm not over here to sell you a bill of goods and, and tell you that Darren McFadden's going to step in and immediately be an elite running back on the Dallas Cowboys. But what I am going to tell you is this. This team has enough talent on their offensive line to make almost any decent running back into a, a high-quality producer at the position. And when I say high-quality, I'm not talking about putting up DeMarco Murray's numbers. That's not going to happen. The Cowboys are not going to replicate what they did in their running game in 2015, uh, what they did in 2014. It's just not going to happen. So you have to really think about what you can do at the position. And, and I think it makes sense to have a Joseph Randall and a Lance Dunbar as guys who are, uh, you know, decent talents. They're, they're not really spectacular or anything like that. But Darren McFadden brings a, a unique ability to the Dallas Cowboys. First of all, obviously, he's, you know, a former Arkansas player. And you know how Jerry Jones love all, loves all those guys. But um, the thing is, is that Darren McFadden is a veteran player who has a lot of physical talent. And I think that he's going to fit in well with the Cowboys. I'm excited to see what he can do. Um, like I said, I'm not expecting them to produce the same amount of, of stats that they did last year. But I do think that the Cowboys are still going to have a quality running game this year. So that's going to do it for this video. Uh, my opponent rage quits right here. But I want to hear what you guys have to say about this whole running back situation. Do you think that the Cowboys made the right decision to let DeMarco Murray walk given the salary cap situation? Or do you think that they should have kept DeMarco Murray and let Des Bryant walk? Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. I'll be interested to hear what you have to say. Um, thank you again for uh, tuning into this video. Hope you guys enjoyed the little video, and I hope that you enjoyed the commentary on the Cowboys. Thank you again, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.